Hello and welcome to this week's Trade of the Week on Tuesday, the 2nd of May. Now, about three weeks ago, we went long the US dollar versus the Japanese yen, and we did so at 133.35. And this trade has worked extremely well. And because we're now close to the March high, we would like to take profit on this trade and get out at 137.41, uh, giving us a profit of over 400 pips on this trade. Now, uh, last week's trade to go short sugar uh, against the trend because we were seeing negative divergence on the relative strength index. And that normally in about 70 to 75 percent of cases leads to at least a short term retracement against the trend. Well, that one didn't work out. So here we lost about uh, 60 cents on that trade going short here. at uh, uh, I believe it was twenty four dollars and forty six cents and we got stopped out above the previous high. So that trade is no longer valid. And uh, this week's trade of the week, what I would like to do is on the back of the uh, unexpected uh, rate hike by the Reserve Bank of Australia earlier today, when it hiked its rates by 25 basis points to 3.85%, and also said that it may have to pursue further monetary tightening uh, in order to reduce the uh, stubbornly high inflation rate in Australia, which uh, currently lies at 7% uh, year on year. Now, that may lead to further upside being seen, and in this case, on this chart versus the uh, New Zealand dollar. So therefore, I would like to go long at uh, 108.04 on uh, this Australian dollar versus New Zealand dollar exchange rate with a stop loss at 106.80 and an upside target at 110.50. So today's trade of the week is to go long the Australian dollar versus the New Zealand dollar at 108.04 with a stop loss at 106.80 and an upside target at 110.50.